Hey Easy Technology fans, in this tutorial we're going to be showing y'all three different methods on how to find available memory slots on Windows 11. Here are three easy ways to check the number of RAM slots available without opening your computer on Windows 11. So the first method we're going to do is by using the task manager. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and select the start menu and type in task manager and go ahead and select the application that pops up. And just a quick tip, you can access the app with the Control plus Alt plus Delete keyboard shortcut, Quick Links menu, which is Windows key plus X keyboard shortcut, and Control plus Shift plus Escape keyboard shortcut. All right, and from here, you wanna go ahead and select the Performance tab, and go ahead and select the Memory tab right on the left-hand side. All right, so it's going to bring you a page like this. And what you want to look for is slots used. So as you can see, it says two out of two. That means I have two out of two memory slots available and used. All right, so that was the first method. Once you do that, you can go ahead and exit this out. And the second method we are going to do to do this is go ahead and open the start menu and type in CMD. So we're going to type in a code to do this. And what you want to do is either right click on this and select run as administrator or simply select run as administrator right over here. Choose yes to allow any administrator changes and it's going to bring up the command prompt. So what you want to type in is this exact code exactly how it appears. All right, so once you type in this exact code or this exact command, what you want to do is simply select enter. And as you can see, it'll give you a number for the max capacity as well as the number of memory devices. So as you can see, the number is the same too, and it is the number of RAM slots available on your device. After you confirm the total amount of slots on your system, you can type in this following command to find the used slots so type in this exact command once again. All right, and once you type in this exact command, once again, go ahead and select enter. And as you can see, it displays the bank label as well as the capacity once again and how many device locators. So as you can see, there are two given device locators. And after you confirm that, you can go ahead and exit this out. So now we are going to do this using a third method, which is going to be the PowerShell to find the available memory slots. Go ahead and select the start menu once again and type in PowerShell. Once again, go ahead and either right click on PowerShell and select one as administrator or go ahead and select run as administrator. Make sure it says Windows PowerShell right over here. Choose yes to allow any changes. Again, it's gonna open up another command prompt with the PowerShell this time, and go ahead and write the exact command I'm going to type. All right, once you type in this exact command, go ahead and select enter. And as you can see, once again, it says the model name, physical memory array, as well as the max capacity. And again, the number of memory slots available, which is the memory devices. And as you can see, it says two right over here. So once you confirm the total amount of slots on the system, go ahead and type in this command to find the used slots. And once you type in this exact command, once again, go
go ahead and select enter and as you can see it says bank label and there are two banks available all right so that concludes my tutorial today i hope you enjoyed it make sure to like the video share it to your friends and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching